Here we are back in the shop for yet another project here. So what we've got is we've got a bunch of kayaks. We actually have six kayaks that we take out. So we take friends and family, get out there as much as we possibly can. But we just recently got rid of our truck. So we are gonna put these on a trailer so we can tow them with my wife's car. So what we did is we went and just to a tractor supply during Black Friday here and we picked up one of their five foot by eight trailers. So what I need to do now is build a rack to where we can actually put four kayaks on this trailer and then the other two will go on the roof rack. So what I did is I went and bought some stuff called Pipe Maker, or Maker Pipe, I can't remember. Um, they got these interesting little clamps here that kind of have this little puzzle pattern to them to kind of lock them together. And everything gets locked together with these uh, Allen head screws here. But you just use half inch conduit. So I got a stack of half inch conduit. I got one of the kayaks that we have here. We have, these are 12 footers. We also have 10 footers. And we're gonna try to build a rack where all four kayaks can rest on top of this. And then we can just drop the oars down in and store those in each one of the kayaks as we're traveling. So what I'm gonna do now is kind of lay these out, see how this fits, and hopefully we can get this thing built here tonight. All right, so I got the kind of basic layout all put together here. Um, I don't have everything cinched down really tight. It's just kind of hand tight right now, just so I can kind of test fit and see how these kayaks are going to work in here. Now, I built this to fit our kayaks in a specific way. So our two spare kayaks that we always bring people with will go on the bottom. And then we have two Old Town kayaks. Those ones will go on the top here. And then the other ones go on my wife's uh, roof rack on her Subaru. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to test fit these before I cinch everything down and make it super tight. And hope everything lines up well. I'm not sure if this center support that I put in here is going to fit with the other kayaks. I only have about a half inch. I'm hoping if I just kind of tilt them as I'm loading them in there, that'll kind of help make everything fit nice and tight. So let me grab these kayaks and let's do a test fit. Well, that's what I was afraid of. That center support's not gonna be able to go there. I was hoping I was gonna have enough room, but it looks like it's a little too snug. So uh, luckily this isn't super tight, so I'll be able to just take that center support out here real quick. And then uh, we'll slide the other kayak down here on the bottom. All right, well those loaded up nice and easy. So what I went ahead and did is I decided to kind of rotate these in here. When I put both green ones on the bottom, it was super, super snug in there, so I really wanted to make this easier. So, like, say if my wife wanted to take some friends out kayaking, this would be quick and easy for her to grab it and load it. So, I'm going to let her know that if we run it this way, it's easier for her to somebody to kind of grab this and load it and, and just go. Uh, the one thing I'm going to have to do, though, is I'm going to have to cut this gate off. Uh, initially, this tailgate here, I was hoping that it had hinges where when you drop down, you can slide it off. They're not. They're actually sealed bearings. So, they're good hinges, but I'm going to end up cutting those off and making it to where I can take this actual tailgate on and off anytime I want. Um, but man, that rack system really worked out well. Came together in just the one night. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take the kayaks back off. I'm going to cinch this thing down. I'm going to put a couple of U-bolts to attach just to the walls of the trailer. Since we'll be driving on the highway, I just want to make sure this thing stays nice and secure. So let me get these off, get this thing all secured up, and then let's get it finished. All right, so after throwing some sparks there, we finally got the tailgate off. Now, if you probably noticed, I put these two pieces of plywood on here. This metal that they have on this trailer is extremely sharp. So as we were sliding the kayaks in there, it was actually cutting some of the plastic. So I put these down as kind of guides just to give it something for the kayaks to slide across. And then what I did here is I went ahead and I fixed some U-bolts. Two on each side and then two up on the front. And that'll keep this whole rack from really moving. So, you know, now, I mean, it moves the whole trailer. It's not going anywhere. So I've gone through and cinched down all these bolts. Got everything down all nice and tight, and everything looks good. Pretty happy with it, so we'll throw the kayaks on it here, and next video we'll get the kayaks out and see how the trailer holds up. All right, but thanks for hanging out for another project with me. I hope you enjoyed it. If you really have any questions, please throw them in that comment section. I'll do what I can to answer them for you. If you really enjoyed this video, hit that like button. If you want to see me get these boats out on the water and see all my other projects and all my other ventures, please hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching. I hope to see you around.